begin! Let the battle begin! Battle stations. Prepare yourself for battle, heroes. And prepare I did. You see, there is no iMac equipped with an i3-2120, and as far as I can tell, they never came with NVIDIA's GT730. But for a Hackintosh build, I'm wondering if maybe, just maybe, this could be a good combination. How do you turn your old $35 Windows breathing PC into an iMac? Well, I would love to say it was easy, but without a real Macintosh computer to work with, not a whole lot of skill with bootloaders and boot flags, it was challenging, but yet rewarding at the same time. I like to figure things out for myself, with maybe a hint or two, but with things like DSDT, AML, SM BIOS, Verbos, Clover, and just about everything else was abbreviated, giving up was almost an option. But then, right out of nowhere, the OS X gods shined their light down upon me, and my blistered finger from four shutdowns started to gain back some feeling. Holy crap, that's an HP Z210 small form factor workstation running high Sierra buttery smooth. But surely, a GT730 can't play games and Macs aren't known for gaming. Hmm, but I wonder... <laughs> Well, I'll be. You can game on a Mac OS, and not too shabby, I might add. Just know this. The software hack is not for everyone, and more than likely, I will install Windows over this to resell this PC to make more videos. However, it's an experience I will not forget, and honestly, it works great. But if you want a Mac, buy a Mac. And now that I'm somewhat interested in the whole thing, I will be putting some bids in on some retro mini Macs just to see what they're all about. So, for now, so long, friends. Battle stations, prepare yourself for battle, heroes. What?